Hello, Carlos. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I am doing great. Very happy to be here. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine, teacher. Welcome, Jenny and Carlos. How was your day? How was your day, Jenny? Mm, it's so tired. Why? Because in the morning I have training that 8 a.m. to 12. Uh -huh. and in the afternoon, I, I complete other tasks that my work. Oh, my God. So you were very busy. Very busy. Oh my god, but the meeting was very long. Oh my god. So all the morning in meeting and then working in the afternoon. All the morning, all days in the week. Really? Uh, signs uh, two weeks ago to, to December uh, 19. So all you... day. Oh my god. Oh all my day god. training in the morning. Well, but that's good. That's good. Oh, it's training. So if it is training, it's cool because, I mean, you learn new things, yeah. right? That is it's a good virtual. thing. It's virtual. Ah, oh my God. Yeah. So <laughs> at least, but the, the thing is the learning, right? I love to take a lot of virtual things and courses, etc. So the learning is the most important. So you imagine that you are in presential training get ready, dressed up, put your camera, participate, like if you were in a real thing. In this training, we 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 must participate because it's evaluate. Oh, okay. That's mm -hmm. important. And at the end, <laughs> uh, we we will uh, tendremos un, un diploma. I don't we, know how uh, We will get a certificate you say we will get a certificate we will get a certificate okay so all the work is going to be well rewarded so do your best effort jenny congratulations for learning that is really important hello Thank astrid you. gladys lily sandra ever josue it hello. is a great pleasure to have you here how was your day It was very productive. Hello. How are you? <laughs> it was very productive, you say. Cool. I love those days that are very productive because you do many things and you feel that you are doing a lot, right? So productive days are very, very good. Thank you, Gladys, for sharing. Josué, how was your day? Uh, not too bad, teacher. <laughs> Hello, Lily. Her coordination is so bad. Yeah, in my case. Hi, Lily. Hi, hi. I am driving yet. But oh, don't, I don't worry. Okay. Uh -huh. In 10 minutes. Okay, so be careful. Be careful. Focus on the on the driving because there is a lot of traffic outside. So please be careful. Okay, don't worry. We're going to be yeah, here. Thank you. Okay. okay. Don't worry. En 10 minutos presenta. No tengo, no tengo pena. <laughs> Presentation. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> No, not at all. Come on. It's just a very short thing. Hoy di los molesté para que vinieran listos con su audio. So I was going to send you a lot of homework, but then I said, no, they have to get ready for the afternoon, for the night. Yeah. It was the only day that it's going to happen. So don't get used to it. No se emocione. It's going to be just today. Ah, well, my dear students, yesterday we started talking a little bit about the ING forms of uh, sentences in gerund phrases, right? 
So we are going to be covering a little bit on that today. You are going to be presenting as well. You are going to be sharing a little bit of the process of the profession that you chose. And for sure, you are going to be also uh, expressing some of the sentences in a simple past, right? With uh, with uh, simple past, sorry, with different phrases to talk about the professions that you are interested in, okay? That is what we are going to be doing tonight. And we are also going to cover some uh, of the exercises related to this unit here, okay? So yesterday night, we were talking about this and let me share my, uh, let me see, let me share my screen. We were talking about uh, gerund phrases. And in this section of the book, let me just share it with you, okay? Ten, ten, ten. Okay, in this section of the book, we were talking about hot jobs. That is what I ask you to present about, right? These are the most uh, like famous jobs around the world, right? And the careers that are going to be very famous in the future, right? For sure, this future was like 10 years ago, but I know that they are still famous, right? Which ones do you consider, my dear people, the most, uh, the most popular professions right now? Which ones do you consider the most popular professions right now? Uh -huh. mm, social media manager. Social media manager. That is a very demanded job, right? Social media manager. What else? What is it? Uh huh. Mm -hmm. About mm -hmm. career and uh, layer. Okay, uh, about a uh, loss, right? Loss. Also, everything about uh, systems and computers and engineering, right? Systems engineering is very popular nowadays because everything is you know, on the computer, right? So you need to work on everything. What other profession do you consider famous nowadays? That you say, no, that is on the top right now. All about environment. Okay, all about the environment. Very good, right? Everything related to the environment, recycling, reusing, and everything. So that is very in right now, right? Very good. And um, do you think that the doctors and all the health uh, area is popular nowadays? Psychology. The psychologists, right? It is pretty sad, but mm -hmm. yes, they are very famous nowadays. Computer science. Okay, yeah, all the computer science are very or, famous. Or software development. Software Innovative. development. Okay, the plumbers, yes, they are very famous nowadays because now it is curious that everything is all and it needs to be fixed, right? But Yes, all about health and all about computers, it's very, very popular. And the ones about software, right? The ones about apps and software and stuff are very, very famous. And you see, the book was not really mistaken on that. Este libro ya tiene sus, sus abriles, pero ya tenía la idea. So imagine you have Simulation engineer, health information technician, green researcher, organic food farmer, and it's social. Capsula del tiempo. <laughs> yes, it's a deja vu. It was a, a, a go back in time, right? Imagine this book, I think it was made in 2004, something like that. So it is pretty, pretty old. And it was very exact on the definitions, right? What is a simulation engineer, people? Help me to check on that. Help me, help me reading. What is a simulation engineer? Oh, 
Who can help me? Only one. Me, Only teacher. One. Go ahead, you please. Tell Thank you. A lot of different kind. Okay. Uh, first, uh, Astrid, and then Sandrita, with the health information technician. Astrid, go ahead. Simulation engineer. You develop different kind of simu simulators, such as flight simulators for training pilots or virtual patient for training medical students. Very good job, right? Simulation engineer. All these toys, all these uh, different human bodies that they use to practice. There are even human bodies who can give birth to a baby, right? I asked the maniquis que ya pueden ver como la acción de parto and the doctors can work on that. And it's like, so like curious to imagine that there is like the, the thing that creates the, the action, right? So this is a simulation engineer. Thank you very much. Sandra, health information technician. Health informatic technician. Do you use computer systems to update patient fields? Files. Which helps, files, which helps doctors diagnose, diagnose and treat patients. Very good. A health informa informatics technician, right? It is like a system that has all your information as a patient, right? Tiene todo su historial médico. And then when the doctor just introduces your information, it's there, everything. It's very, very curious. Gladys, green researcher. Yes, I like that. Green researcher. Your research new environmentally friendly technologies for fields such as transportation, energy, and recycling. Okay. I think <laughs> it says you research new environmentally friendly, right? Environmentally friendly, porque van juntas, porque están relacionadas, right? Environmentally friendly technologies for fields such as transportation, energy, and recycling. Recycling. Organic food farmer, Josue Isaias. Thank you very much. And Jenny will help me with social media manager. Okay, organic food, food farmer. You grow healthy food in a sustainable, sustainable way without using a harmful um, pesticides, 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 pesticides or chemicals. Chemicals, right? Chemicals. Uh, chemicals, okay. Yeah, chemicals, like my chemical romance, Chemical. right? El que tuvo su etapa yeah. emo, por ahí por el 2000, <laughs> lo, lo sabe. <laughs> uh, you grow healthy food in a sustainable way without using harmful pesticides or chemicals. Jenny, go ahead. Social media manager, you control the representation of a company's brand online on sites like Facebook, Twitter, and others. Very good job. Thank you very much, Jenny. The social media manager control the representation of a company's brand online on sites like Facebook, Twitter, and others. So from these five jobs, which one would you like to have? ¿Por cuál se interesarían ustedes? Green researcher. Green researcher. Any other example? In my case, simulation engineer. Oh. Okay, simulation engineer. Uh huh. What else? Um, social media media manager. Social media manager. Good. Social media, social media manager, manager for me. Social media manager oh. for Manuel as well. Good. Simulation engineer. Simulation engineer for Jenny. Good. Me too. Excellent. Another simulation engineer. No one for organic food farmer? Que nadie coma. <laughs> Teacher. Eh, yeah. Me he dado cuenta que, que ahora ya casi la gente que trabajaba la tierra, así como lo. lo ¿Cómo se llama? Farmer. Eh, ya no. No, no, we don't have, we don't have 
and and that's a very complicated thing that many people who used to grow things who used to work on the land in the landfills planting coffee and stuff they don't work anymore no and it is i mean i feel so happy when my cilantro leaves and I, I don't know why people do not plant their own things. Uh, you know, when I was, I was in a scholarship in Arkansas for almost two months, right? And everybody in their houses plant carrots, vegetables, cilantro, chilies, everything. And they have these little gardens at home because uh, Fruits and vegetables are very expensive in the United States. Yeah, I went to a supermarket and one avocado, one little avocado was $5. And I said, ¿Qué? Con cinco dólares dan tres docenas allá. <laughs> yeah. And I said, like, en mi pueblo, tres docenas te dan por un dólar. But, uh, I mean, it is, it is like that. And once you feel that you are losing it, then people start growing. Yo creo que aquí en El Salvador la única que sobrevive es la caña de azúcar que siguen cosechándola. Teacher. ¿Ya? ¿Cómo se dice? Así como se gana, así se gasta. Uh, yeah. Like you earn, you spend. Like you earn, you spend. Like you earn, you spend. ¿Ya? And it is like that, exactly like that, because you get a lot of money, but then you waste a lot of money as well. Everything is very expensive. So no organic food farmers. Okay, so vamos a morir de hambre. Health information technicians? No? Nothing. <laughs> Gladys, okay, health information, maybe. So many, many of you go for the engineering or the social media, right? I know they are very interesting and for sure they are more and more attractive, right? Cool. So for me, it's okay all behind the scene. Oh yeah, definitely. So this is the part that you were working on. And I explained it to you yesterday a little bit, right? Being a flight attendant sounds very exciting. Flying all the time will be fun. In this case, you are using two different gerund phrases, right? Being a flight attendant and flying all the time. And in this case, as you can see, you don't have a subject on the sentence. This is the subject of the sentence. But the flight attendants get tired of traveling. They spend most of their time in airports. Designing clothes is not a man's job. Women are much more fascinated by fashion. I will enjoy working with animals. I think working as a veterinarian could be rewarding. I am not so sure. Animals can be very unpredictable. Getting a dog bite will be scary, right? Another German phrase. I would like to work in the television industry. Directing a TV show will be really interesting. And the last two, that's not true. Many great clothing designers are men. Just look at Calvin Klein. I disagree. Working in front of the camera as an actor will be much more satisfying. So now I go and I throw the ball on your side. You are going to tell me about your profession. Which one did you choose? And why do you consider some advantages or disadvantages over it? Okay. So I don't have a specific order for you to start presenting. Remember, it is just like one minute or a little bit more that you are going to talk. But uh, I, I am, can yeah? I can I present first, please? Ah, sure, for sure. I need to go out. Aha, ve que bonita. <laughs> but uh, stay connected yeah. in the class, okay? Pero deje la okay. clase conectada. Because, uh, yeah. Because of the of the of the recording, I, I am in, in a rural place, and here is difficult the connection. So I need to move on, and I need to take advantage of the Wi-Fi that I have in this moment. <laughs> That's the reason why. Okay, good, good, good. Yeah, move. 
<laughs> my dog. <laughs> okay, sorry. <laughs> Kiara is, is very, very happy to, to be here. Just get, let me get a pencil because I need to take notes of your presentations and then okay. we will start. So okay. Lily will be the first one presenting and mm -hmm. we are going to go. Oh, okay. What a big mess I made. <laughs> okay. Por alcanzar un lapicero, destrocé todo lo demás. What a crazy moment. Okay. So, Lily, go ahead. Okay. Thank you. A profession that is interesting for me is fly attendant. I consider it's a fascinating career because you know different people, go to a variety of places, and you can meet other cultures too. Part of the benefits is that you can travel with your family in vacation, you have discount of flights, you can sleep in beautiful hotels, and you go to shopping to other countries. Uh, you don't need to pay for your food <laughs> and you are working. <laughs> you have access to the debris in the airport. Uh, the difficulties about being a flight attendant is that you don't have a regular schedule to work. Uh, if it is required, you need to travel at night, at weekends, uh, special days, and that's it's difficult because maybe you cannot be on um, a special birthday or Christmas, um, days like that. And you don't stop working through meteorological conditions. So there are a risk for yourself too. That's it. Okay, good. What a beautiful presentation you made. Definitely. It was very clean, uh, very organized, to the point, good vocabulary, right? The, I, I could actually see the difference between any audio that you just sent, right? Como cualquier audio que lo hubiéramos yeah. mandado así a la carrera, like something that you actually organize your ideas, and it was very good. The only correction that you have, like, you, you cannot be with your family at special days. You say, like, on a special days. It's not uh, okay. at, but on. But for the rest, Lillian, it was very good. It was a very good presentation. People, reactions for Lily, please, oh. because it was a very good presentation. So Thank congratulations. You. Great job. You, you did a very good job. Lily. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Who's going to I, continue? I, 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 will, I will be connected, but maybe I lose the Wi-Fi, okay? Okay, don't worry. We hope to we hope to have you here, but please listen and if you have comments about your friends you can put them on the chat okay okay thank you thank you Bye. very much any anyone else who wants to continue who wants to continue uh, me teacher. okay thank you Josue. go ahead okay uh, the profession i admire the most Bye, is being a scientist is being a scientist <laughs> Uh, the scientists have been very important for the development of human life. Working as a scientist means making discoveries, affirming or, the, or refuting theories, understanding the, phys the physical working of the universe, uh, nurturing human knowledge, and correcting all statements. The, most important uh, discovery of present time was, um, I don't know how to say, El Boson de Higgs in English, but what's this? El Boson de Higgs. And uh, this meant finding a new particle. That's all. Oh, if it is like that, but let me investigate. <laughs> let me investigate that. Uh, okay. Hey, what a cool presentation that, that you got. I really, I really can see that uh, you can 
I mean that you admire scientists. Yes. yes. Definitely, I can see that. Yes. Oh, boss, boss on the Higgs. Ah. Boss. Okay, good, good, good. Now I know it. And okay, let me see if I can find it. Higgs Busong. <laughs> there is no change Higgs. on that one. Oh, okay. Higgs, Higgs Busong. Higgs Busong. Busong. Right? Busong. Okay. Higgs Busong. Okay. That's that's the way it, it is. Thank you very much, uh, Josue. I really like your Thank presentation. You. Reactions for Josue, people. Very good job. Congratulations. You did a very fantastic job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now we go with Olivia. Good evening. Hello. I would, I would like to be a reporter, reporter because I think it is an exciting career. Um, you can be close with the facts, give the information to the population in real time, and the advantage no win place, uh, people, countries, celebrities, and disadvantages, the dangers that you can face, where the news is generated, generate sanctions, threats, etc. etc. Okay, so you want to be a journalist or a reporter? What do you want to be, a journalist or a reporter? A reporter. A reporter, good, a reporter. So where the news are generated. Yes, I think many of us dream about being a reporter once in, a, in, in our lifetime. ¿Quién más soñó alguna vez ser un reportero? I, I wanted to be there. I wanted to be on the news, pero yo era de las que quería estar en la... En la Bienvenidos a las noticias. <laughs> I wanted to be on the on the studio, not on the street. Y en right? castellano. Bienvenidos todos, tíos y tías. ¿Cómo están? <laughs> In El Salvador. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, let me see. Thank you very much. Reactions for our friend. Very good. Thank you, Olivia, for your presentation. Right? Short, to the point, good. Right, very well made. Thank you. The only the pronunciation of generated, right? Generated. Who's next? Who's um, next? Go ahead. Um, I really admire um in profession. Um, because they are living a lot of time on the sea. So I think that is that this profession is really exciting because they are looking for new discoveries every day. Um, and everything related to marine fauna. Also um, is dangerous in the case. Um, five things for the marine geologist to do is Study in marine life in a natural, uncontrolled environment. Um, collect data in specimens. Um, study characteristics of species. Um, assess human impact and monitoring and manage population. And that's it. Okay, good. A marine uh, geologist ah, from the ocean. <laughs> Thank you very much, Jose Arturo. Yeah. Very curious profession indeed. It is a very curious thing. And for sure, uh, it is really nice. <laughs> He's breathing out in the air. Poor Gladys. No saque al chuchito, hombre. Go and get it. Salir. El quiso salir. Ya regreso. Jesucristo cierra el refri por el perro. Okay. So, thank you very much. Thank you, Jose Arturo. Reactions for Jose Arturo, people. Very good profession. It is very interesting. And many people do not like that. Okay. 
Ok. Está en contra. Ya ven que todos se pronuncian en contra del pobre perro que han dejado afuera. <laughs> Alejandra, go ahead. Thank you, Jose Arturo. Very interesting. I think an interesting career or profession is to be a singer. So an advantage are that you can, well, you do what you love if you like music. Uh, you can travel around the world because you do world tours and things like that. And you also have your own schedule depending on your activities as an artist. And you will meet another artist too. So this advantage are that you you can do like like things that other people do because there's a lot of people around you like looking looking at you. If you do some mistakes, there's gonna be like a lot of hate to you and things like that. There's gonna be a lot of people like not who's gonna do it. Ah, judging you, judging, yeah, judging. you. <laughs> and also, you have a lot of pressure. Okay, so an artist. It is very curious that uh, to think about that because you can say, I am going to have all the fame of the world. But when you have fame, you don't have privacy anymore because all your life is public, right? An actress, an actor, a singer, any type of career related with this uh, fame in, in all this live world, it's complicated. But we will be like, hey, Alejandra va a tener concierto. Vamos al concierto de Alejandra. Oh, yo la conocí en la clase. We are going to be very lucky, right? Todos ustedes van a tener tickets gratis for Alejandra's shows. <laughs> I think no, teacher. <laughs> business is business. Business is business and friendship is friendship. Good, Alejandra. Very nice. A reaction, please, for Alejandra. Very nice career, the one that you chose, right? And for sure, fame has the disadvantages of no privacy. Gladys, go ahead. Yeah. Well, being a psychologist sounds a great profession. Because I like to analyze human mind and behavior starting with myself of course i like to discover and understand the reason for certain behavior that are known as uncommon each mind is a world you know but there are some that attract more attention than others but the main reason why i'm fascinated by understanding is because I would like to be able to help those who have a ailment in that field. Um, it, <laughs> the disadvantage in that profession is that it's still like a taboo for which they will say if I am crazy, et cetera, et cetera. Exactly. That is one of the most complicated issues about human behavior, that they think that if you look for help, it's because you are sick or something or you are crazy. And also a lot of anxiety, depression, mental issues, that when you feel desperate, when you feel stressed, look for help. Yeah. Yo creo que buscar ayuda psicológica, psiquiátrica eh, es necesario. A veces es necesario. Y usted dice, no, estoy bien, estoy bien. And your eyes like, uh, <ríe> y al ojo se le cierra el estrés, ¿verdad? No, pero estoy bien, estoy bien. <ríe> Desmayada, media caí. So, please, eh, yes, look for help, psychologist. It is a very, very respectful eh, career. Reactions for our future psychologist. Fotógrafa y psicóloga. Okay. Le tomo la foto y la analizo. <risa> you see? Hey, si se hace famosa. Le la foto. <risa> si se hace famosa con eso, me tiene que dar los dividendos. Good. <risa> Te analizo la foto. 
Jenny Sanchez, go ahead. Good evening. Uh, one of the most interesting profession for me is paramedic. Well, I don't know if paramedic is trade or professions. It's I don't okay. know, uh -huh. but I for me is very interesting because they are to they are the first to attend to people in case of accident. One of the disadvantages is when the when they when they cannot arrive on time to save a life. And yeah. advantage is that I I be, I believe that it must be very satisfying when they when they help in on time. The paramedics. It is one of the most uh, important things because I mean the doctor makes its part, the nurse makes its part, but the paramedics are the ones that are in, at the moment, right? The ones who get the patient and everything. So they are the ones who act first. So very, very good presentation, very detailed for sure. Reactions for Jenny, thank you very much. And our future paramedic, you can do it as well. And many paramedics here in El Salvador are volunteers in the Green Cross. So, y todos esos no ganan nada, pero ahí están trabajando, sirviendo. So thank you, Jenny, for that beautiful, beautiful profession that you are interested in. Thank you, Griselda, go ahead. Good night, evening. Hello, good evening. Uh, the profession are interesting to, to me is the doctor. Uh, the benefit the are no we we receive it. Uh, this is for the is the doctor you the doctor is 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 can help other people and mm -hmm. save life and many people are now is the she work in the hospital uh, in a GI is a children's woman men uh, the patient um in the difficulties difficult difficulties uh, she study no he he is study studying for uh, is more is very expensive uh, the, la carrera universitaria is very expensive uh, the career the career yeah the career the career the doctor is very expensive uh, he he have few clients because the consultation is expensive uh, in few in few okay okay occasions algunas veces es muy cara la consulta okay uh, only that. okay visiting the doctor can be expensive yes and then you have and then you have a gerund phrase si cambiamos eso por eh, some of the uh, treatments are expensive you say visiting the doctor can be very expensive right uh, going with the doctor can be very expensive as well so uh, when you say he is studying for it very expensive you say la sería mejor right studying to be a doctor can be very expensive and doctors can help other people yes and you say children's women and men the correct is children women and men right children women and men so let's try to build it up a little bit on griselda si me lo puede escribir porfa griselda lo que lo que tenía ahí para, para, para presentar en un mensaje directo a whatsapp yo le puedo hacer las correcciones necesarias y enviárselo okay 
Thank you. Thank you, Griselda. I will be waiting for that. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Uh, who's next? Me, teacher. Thank you. Go ahead. Public, public accounting is a career that is very important for people and companies. It is necessary, necessary to keep track uh, or of what's invested. That from a small store, medium and large company, it is necessary to know what financial situation of the company is the any time. It's at any time. The public accounting accountant is a specialist on this, and not only to keep control but to guide companies to invest in better conditions and get more profit. Control, control are need necessary to know um, to know the tax situations inclusive. Uh, it is a profession closely, closely related uh, to the numbers. It is a career for very organized and focused people. I am a degree in public account. account. <laughs> yeah, yes. I, yeah, if you tell me I have, or I am a degree, yo soy un diploma. No, I have a degree. And I you say, public account. yes, it is related, very related and organized, yes. related with numbers, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, I totally admire the public accountants or any type of accountant. I do admire all of them because they are very organized. They are very careful with numbers and they have all this world that I really, no, right now. Yeah, yo me gradué de contaduría pública tres años en bachillerato, but no, it was not my, my thing. It was very complicated and I said like, mm -hmm. Maybe not. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I was I more into. Them. Yeah, it's like no, no, no. It's like no, no, no. I, I. It is difficult. It is very difficult, and I really admire. So, yes, fucking. It is very complicated. Reactions for your friends, please. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Reactions for your friends. Thank you very, very much. For Griselda as well. Yeah, we did a very good job. For Alejandra. Yeah, Alejandra, we gave her reactions yeah and for jenny yeah. right. good sandra cecilia go ahead uh, i think a uh, contractor in the united states is a great job because you have a lot of materials and you can do everything to imagine in the program for property brothers you see how you can fix a house right from the start and a large amount of equipment that will be interesting to use at least once. In general, it, it is great, but I have heard that it is a very demanding job, fluctuating, and that it requires require passion and knowing how to handle people from different cultures or ways of seeing the things. You, right? You need to be very detailed, very careful, very, like it, it is very complicated for the person in charge. So it is interesting, right? And if you like it, you can pursue that career. Not only in the United States, but also here in El Salvador. I know there is better because you have everything, right? I attend the todo. But here in El yes, Salvador, yes. it is it can be complicated, it's but not limited. impossible. It's very limited here, even the space and everything, right? Empezando por el espacio. Hágame una de las cinco plantas aquí, mire. Hmm, tenemos tres metros cuadrados. And the money. <laughs> and the money. <laughs> so it's like, Maybe not, but arriba. <laughs> it will be good. Good. Thank you, Sandra. Thank you very, very much. Reactions for Sandrita, please. Very nice profession, the one that you chose. Who's next? Me, teacher. 
Thank you, Carlos. Go ahead. Okay, uh, from my view, the most exciting uh, career is computer engineering in as much as it's a branch of electrical engineering that integrate several fields of computer science and electronic engineering required to develop computer hardware and software. Um, computer engineer not only require training in electronic engineering, um, software design and hardware software integration, but also in software engineering. It uses the techniques and principle of electrical engineering and computer science, um, but also covers areas such as artificial intelligence, robotics, computer networks, uh, computer architecture, and operating system. Uh, you can you can pick up uh, whatever fields you uh, uh, that you want. Of course, uh, there are many fields where you uh, choose. For instance, um, then a database management, uh, web design or of course, if you want to create new new things, uh, for, for instance, uh, software development. And if you want to prefer and uh, make better decision, then you can choose uh, other fields for, for instance, um, big data. It's a field where you choose, um, uh, take take many data. 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 Well, data, data. data. Okay, they go ahead, they go ahead. <laughs> uh, data <laughs> or data. <laughs> then you analyze every, every data and then you make in better decision for for whatever business that you you are to to work for, for okay that you are um, going to work for good you know um, <clears throat> this uh, engineering software computer and everything engineering world it's really really big and you have so many things to discover and everything is involved because it involves mathematics, English, numbers, a little bit of science, a little bit of, a, a, I don't know, you have to be very creative in order to create all, all these things. It's not like just click, 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 and that's it, right? No solo dale click y tú, reinicia y ya está. So it, it, it has a lot more involved. Very good. And when you say, and indeed, right, indeed, you have it. And in fact, right, most of the world there. And for instance, right, for instance, the word for instance. Okay. Good, Carlitos. Thank you very much for your profession. I know you love it. Thank you very, very much. Reactions for Carlitos people. Thank you. Let's continue with Who's going to continue? Who's going to continue? Me teacher. Okay. <laughs> Luis Roberto and then Astrid. Okay. I find it interesting to be a active director. We're in the commercial field of the advertising field or in the musical field. It seems very interesting to be, to meet to be able to interpret some someone's ideas and project in the best way. And uh, additional this girl allows you to know many people. But the other side is a very stressful profession because the projects a little bit times. 
<laughs> okay, yes, it is a little bit stressing, but it's also very rewarding. So uh, it is really awesome when you have the opportunity to actually help and create ideas, ideas from others when you can interpret, interpret them. And for sure, when you can transmit other people's ideas. That is really, really good. Thank you, Luis Roberto, for that interesting profession. I really like it as well. I am very interested in that as well, right? También me gustó un montón eso. Thank you. Thank you, Luis Roberto. Astrid, Michelle, go ahead. Hey, good evening. Hi. The, the career that I find most interesting is international relations because this major is a certified way to improve your decision making, analytical and interpersonal skills. You gain a comprehensive understanding of society, people, globalization, and multinational markets. And over this course of the study, you will develop um, develop case skills that can easily be applied to many other industry or non-governmental organization. And you will get the chance to improve your abilities and in your public speaking communication, the data um, analysis, uh, cooperation, and critical thinking, and also the conflict resolution. And I consider that this career is so nice because that was the career that I studied. <laughs> and one of the disadvantages is that this career is relatively new. So there are many people that doesn't know what, what we do. Yes, it is, it is really beautiful. It is a beautiful career. That was my first option at the university. I wanted to study international relationships. It was like, yes, I want to do it, right? But eh, in Santana, they didn't have that major, right? En, en su momento en Santana no estaba. And I was like, ah, crying because of that. And I had, I, I went and I studied languages that which I don't regret at all, but it is a very, very beautiful major, international relationships. All the people that you can get to know, right? Astrid, look for grants, look for uh, support. Busque siempre Astrid, apoyo, hay muchas, muchas becas, becas en la embajada, hay muchas becas en, y en todas las embajadas de muchos países. Vaya y busque y, y, y salte ahí al, al, al mundo. And it is going to be very, very beautiful. Okay, so now every opportunity that I see, I am going to send it to you. Thank you, Astrid. Very beautiful profession, international Thank relationships. You. Thank you very much. And let's see, let's continue with Luis Fernando. Go ahead. Yes. Good evening. Hi. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I was uh, on the microphone. Okay. Uh, okay, the, I'm talking about like a lawyer. That is not my, my interesting career. So I am an engineer. Yes, but I think that the lawyer is very important in our society. I think in the lawyer, the importance of having a lawyer more than just problem solvers, a lawyer can help prevent problems or even coming into, into friction. 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 While most, while most people seek the AID, of this legal, of this legal uh, problems, only uh, when, when problem. The thing is the, I think the a lawyer uh, needs to be let to prevent pro problems in legal uh, issues. Yes, and the, I think the uh, all the society, all the person needs to be an advice, I guess, from a lawyer. Yes, I, I, yeah. I, as I told you, I, I am not a lawyer. I am engineer. 
But you are interested. I, I, yeah, I, I want to be talk about it. Thank you. That's, that's pretty Thank awesome, you. Luis. And it is nice that even when you are not on that major, you, you really like it and you say, hey, this is a major that really gets my attention, right? Very, very nice, right? I am not like Thank that, you. but I, I like it. Thank you very much. Lawyers are very necessary. And yeah, si la gente buscara un abogado antes que el problema se hiciera tan grande, otro gallo nos cantara. Pero no, hasta que ya estamos en el pleito, buscamos al abogado. So, look for advice. And it is necessary and it is beneficial, right? Y ser más económico al inicio. And, and it is cheaper, de definitely, it is cheaper. Very good. Thank you, Gladys, for the advice. I am going to call the attendance in a very quick way. And I am missing, let me see, Paola. And... Present. No, Paolita, usted me falta todavía de presentar. Me. Yes. Me. And Jasmine. And... Who else? And Ever, Ever de Jesús as well. Okay, I am going to call the attendance right away. Alejandra Cristina. Here. Okay. Eh, Astrid Michelle. Here, teacher. Blanca Estela. Carlos Alfredo. Claudia Yanet. Thank you. Claudia Yanet. Ever de Jesús. Present. Thank you. Eh, let me see. Gabriel Stephanie. Present. Gladys Imelda. Present. Griselda Elizabeth. Present. Teacher. Jasmine Vanessa. Present, Miss. Joaquín Ruperto. Here I am, teacher. Jose Arturo. I'm present. Thank you. Jose Manuel. Josué Isaías. Present teacher. Thank you. Eh, Luis Fernando. Present. Luis Roberto. Present teacher. Thank you. Present. Madeline Gabriela. Manuel Aristides. Olivia Emanuel. Present teacher. Paola María. Present. Rosa Esmeralda. Presente. Thank you. Sandra Cecilia. Present. Walter René and Jenny Maritza. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Mr. Walter. Walter, Walter. Present, present teacher. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, my dear class. I am going to have time for, uh, let me see, Paola Maria, go ahead. Yes, the profession that I consider most interesting to me is doctor. The doctor spent a lot of time and passion in help, helping others. Other, it's, uh, it is also very exhausting by the hours they are spent in the hospital and complete by facing deep and very difficult case, but they always get all their dedication. Okay, when they face death, death, you say. And for sure, that is a very, very admirable profession because they are dedicated to keep you okay and keep you right, alive and everything, but they face a lot of challenges. Thank you, Paola Maria, for your participation. And for uh, the ones that I am missing, I am missing uh, a couple, I'm missing like four or five of you. I am going to finish with this first time in the class tomorrow, and then we're going to study about suffixes and comparatives, okay? Mañana al iniciar la clase, terminamos con los que se nos quedaron pendientes, que son bien poquitos, son alrededor de cuatro o cinco. Yeah, cuatro. Cinco, yes. So please uh, get ready for that. And then we are going to study suffixes and comparatives tomorrow. 
por si pueden irse a dar una leidita un poquito acerca de qué son los suffixes, qué son los comparatives, en the superlatives for you to keep it fresh. Yo sé que ya los conocen, que ya los han estudiado, pero pueda que se nos hayan olvidado. Y de repente se nos sale un more easy por ahí en la vida. Easier. <laughs> okay, so that's what we're going to study tomorrow. Have a beautiful night, my dear class. And I'm going to see you tomorrow. Ever, tell me. Oh, you're telling me bye-bye. Get ready for tomorrow, Ever. I want to listen to your presentation. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye.